Hi guys, welcome to my channel. This is Charlotte's Foliage, and I hope you subscribe, like, and share. I just wanted to touch base with you and say Happy New Year and let you take a little look at my um, foliage here. I have a few plants that I've been growing and they're doing fairly well. Um, this plant here is brand new. It's a Cebu Blue. I was um, recently propagated it um, it was a cutting that I purchased and then I rooted it in water and then I put it in soil and it's doing really well. Um, this is my snake plant and I don't have to do a whole lot with it. It doesn't require a lot of water and so it's easy to take care of. This is my lemon lime pothos. It's kind of changing its color so recently I purchased some grow lights because I believe it's not getting the kind of light that it's used to receiving. So as, as you can see here, I have new grow lights. They came yesterday. So that was pretty exciting. Or was that day before yesterday? Then I have my lemon, I mean, uh, my philodendron Brazil. And she's doing well. And I have her climbing up a little pole here that I've attached to the soil. And so I'm really pleased with how she's growing. I also have my um, Aglaonema. She's pink and beautiful. She's doing really well and she's putting off some new growth. And so I am able to soon um, propagate her, separate her, and then we'll have some more plants. You can see right here, there's a brand new baby coming up. And uh, like I said, she's doing really well. Also, I have my Calathea Ornata. And she's doing well too. Um, kind of a slow grower right now. and um, But she's doing fairly well. This is my Scandapsis Pictus. And she too is growing on a pole and doing very well. And I love her foliage and how shiny and silky she looks. And I just love her. And then I also have my cylindrical plant here and she has done very well. And she has a new baby there in the back, as you can see. So doesn't require a whole lot of care. Uh, all these plants are in a south-facing window, uh, my deck door actually, so they're doing really well. I have my Carnosa Compacta, and she's doing well. I have a aloe vera plant behind her, and uh, again, these plants are doing really well considering this is the time when a lot of plants go dormant. And I'll pan down a little bit. Hopefully you can see this. But I have um, a Peperomia plant there. I also have a Transcanthia plant there. Um, on the lower shelf, I have some Pothos. Um, so they're doing fairly well too. I have a Pothos Enjoy, and I have a Variegated Golden Pothos, and then I have a Red Maranta here, and she's just doing really well. She's shooting out new growth and just, just a beautiful plant. I really don't even have the shelf space. I've also was able to cut her back and make new plants. Um, so we have those downstairs, so my husband can enjoy those. Um, my husband bought me this succulent vase for my birthday, and so I'm enjoying that under the lights here as well. Um, this just gives you an idea of some of the plants that I have and how I care for them. We'll talk about that in another video. That is my figly fig there. And she's doing pretty good, too. So I'm very pleased with that. I had to recently purchase a um, new 
humidifier and I was told this brand Lavoie is really good so I want to see how she's working I need to put some more water in there so you can't really see that it's on and then you can see my bird of paradise over there I have another snake plant um, on the mantle there but um, again